WHO health experts have declared that the MPOX outbreak still constitutes a global health emergency. The decision was based on the rising number of cases, operational challenges and the need to mount a joint response to end it. 19 African countries have recorded MPOX cases since the start of the year. MPOX is a viral infection that spreads through close contact with infected people or wild animals. The DRC is the epicenter of the outbreak with more than 40,000 cases and over 1,000 deaths since January. Authorities are continuing to carry out measures to stop the disease from spreading further. What really concerns us in the DRC is that the virus is still circulating. The issue of lifting or maintaining the international public health emergency on MPOX will not affect the system that the DRC has set in place to tackle the outbreak. We will continue with the efforts we are making to prevent it from spreading across borders. Earlier this year, health experts detected a new strain of the virus in eastern DRC that's more infectious than the one that was reported globally in 2022. The strain known as Clade 1B spread to the DRC's neighboring countries, prompting the WHO to declare MPOX a public health emergency of international concern in August. The declaration is supposed to enable the global health body to rapidly mobilize funds coordinate the response and accelerate the development of vaccines for emergency use. The DRC has received more than 350,000 doses of vaccines from the European Union and the U.S. so far. Authorities say over 50,000 people have been vaccinated in areas with the highest number of cases. The government plans to roll out a vaccination program in the capital, Kinshasa, next week. Chris Sochamringa, CGTN, Kinshasa, Democratic Republic of Congo.